You know times are changing when you see electric vehicle charging bays being installed at gas stations, and that's exactly what's happening around Lane County. Both gas stations and even car dealerships are now juicing up charging options. In KZI 9 News reporter Joey Vaca spoke to EV drivers passing through our area about how new chargers help fill a need. Uh, so people are out and about driving, and it's wonderful to have uh, access right there off of I-5. As more electric vehicle chargers are popping up around the area, the ARCO and AMPM in Springfield will be adding its own. It may sell gas, but given its location, manager Brad Netherby is excited to see them go in. We, we were really thrilled to have them there. Uh, we weren't sure at first, but as you know, it's getting closer and closer. We're looking more along the lines of seeing just how well these can actually do. Considering we're right off I-5, uh, you know, the summer months, that freeway is extremely busy. Jared Pastor is a Tesla driver traveling down I-5 this week. In his time behind the wheel of an EV, he's seen the benefits of having chargers close to the interstate, like this spot near the Holiday Inn in Springfield. You know, you don't really get mileage anxiety is what I like to call it. Uh, you know, right when you get off the freeway, it's not some crazy maze where you have to try and find the, the charging ports. It's, it's pretty simple. Um, you know, in the Tesla, you put the mileage or you put the address, excuse me, and it shows you the charge points as you go. So that really helps. Just like EV chargers right off the freeway can help travelers, EV chargers in more remote locations can help the businesses they're close to. A lot of these EV charging stations were placed around stores that didn't really necessarily get a whole lot of uh, service, uh, a lot of foot traffic. And so now I see uh, lots of smaller businesses like these gas stations, uh, small little mom and pop restaurants generating revenue because of where all these EV charging stations are placed. And while stopping for a charge might not be as easy as filling up a gas tank, Pastor says it has benefits of its own. It takes about 45 minutes for a full charge. Um, it gives you an excuse to stretch the legs. So when you're driving, I think it's important to kind of do that. Um, keeps you awake on the road after you, you walk around for a little bit while it charges, so it's, it's real nice. The Springfield Arco's chargers are expected to be built by the end of the year. Reporting in Springfield, Joey Vaca, KZI 9 News.